Hey guys, it's Nala from NT Farms and you're welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I will be talking about what you need or what you need to do before you start a poultry farm. So before you even think of starting a poultry farm, you need to ask yourself a few questions. You need to find out what part of poultry farming you are interested in. Is it egg production, meat production, poultry feed production, or even hatching of day old chicks? If you are interested in rearing of birds, what type of birds are you into? Is it chicken, quail, duck, or even turkey? It depends on what you want to do. Where am I setting up the farm? Am I going small by using a small space behind my house or going big by buying a piece of land? What are the basic things every poultry farm needs? Will I be able to provide that? What is the estimate of money that I need to take care of X number of beds? Do I even have the resources to achieve this? And the only way you can answer most of these questions is by information gathering, which is the first step you need to take when starting a poultry farm. In as much as the internet is very useful and helpful, my advice is for you to find a local farmer in your area who is willing to provide you with the information you need. Also try to get information from different sources. That is exactly what we did. For us, we had two farmer friends, an agri officer friend, and the internet. So for every stage in building a farm, we would get info from all of them, compare the info and decide which step to take. I did mention earlier that you need to ask yourself how you are setting up the farm. You need to find out if you are going small by using maybe a small space behind your house or going big by buying a piece of land. So the question is, why do I even need space? And the answer? You need space because you need to set up a structure for your beds. Irrespective of the farming system you choose, a structure or shelter for your beds is very important. This is because you need to protect them from snakes, rats, and thieves. You also need to protect them from natural elements such as the scorching sun and rainfall. So a structure for your beds is also very, very important when setting up your farm. The last but never the least is money. So whether you're starting on a smaller scale or a large scale, you need some amount of money to start a poultry farm. So let me just run you through the list of things you might need money for. You first of all need money to build a structure for your chicks. You need to provide them with basic amenities such as water and electricity because they need light to keep warm when they are day old chicks. You also have to actually purchase the beds and when they come in, you need to provide them with food, water and vaccines. You also have to buy equipment such as feeders and drinkers and mind you, the ones you use for them when they are a day old to about three weeks is not what you use for them when they grow older. If you are not running the farm alone, you need to employ a worker to take care of the beds. You also need to provide a structure for that worker to stay on the farm. The list actually goes on and on. And this is why money or a startup capital is also very, very, very important when you are starting a farm. So these are the three things that, in my opinion, every farmer needs to start a poultry farm. Thank you so much for watching NT Farms and do remember to subscribe for more videos like this. Thank you.